your girl, Asia Damania, back at you with another video. Welcome to my channel and you know the rest. So today I am once again headless, but I'm very prepared for this video and I'm really excited because this is going to be a great way for you to pamper yourself before a big event, your birthday, prom, a pageant, or just on a rainy day when you need something to do and you just feel like giving yourself a spa day. This is going to be a great recipe. So this, recipe. the contents in this bucket are my secret to getting sexy, silky, smooth legs. And I know it may look kind of gross, you can see it, it may look kind of gross, but this is going to be our secret weapon to getting those sexy, smooth legs that are highly desired. So here's so, a list of things that you're going to need for this recipe. You're going to need a one and a quarter cup of sugar, just regular white sugar. You're also going to need a half cup of oil. You can use olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, lavender oil, coconut oil, whatever kind of oil you choose to use, you can use it. And also three tablespoons of citrus, lime, or lemon juice, which you can get at Walmart for pretty cheap, or you can just buy some lemons and squeeze them into the bucket. You're also going to need some disposable razors. I would not recommend using your regular, you know, really nice Venus razor because it's going to get really clogged. So just pick up some just disposable razors like this from like Dollar Tree or Dollar General and you should be set. You may not need three or four like I have lined up here, but it's always good to have it just in case you need it. So um, you're going to mix all those things together in a bowl and then you're going to soak your legs in a tub. Now just a precaution, once you start doing this and rubbing it on your legs and rinsing it off and shaving and whatnot, your tub is going to get extremely dirty and extremely slippery. So really be careful and don't be alarmed at how dirty it's getting. It's just going to be the dead cells and the hair that's coming off of your legs. So don't be afraid so by that. A rundown of the steps for this Pinterest recipe. The first one we've already done, we've already mixed our concoction into this lovely bowl already and I've already soaked my legs in the tub behind me about five minutes and the next step I did was to shave my legs so my legs are already pre-shaved and many people are probably going to be like well my legs feel, feel, feel great right now why do I need to continue on with this video well, I'm, I'm definitely going to show you. If you're following along with me right now, you're going to find out in the next 5 or 10 minutes. Trust now here's me. where the messy part comes in, which is why I have my towel underneath me. You're really going to want a towel, trust me, on this one. So now we're going to massage this mixture onto your legs once you stir it up again, okay? So now that you've stirred it up a little better, take about a tablespoon of it at first. You don't want to use too much or too little, so we're going to apply it little by little onto your leg. Kind of start with this one. Just going to plop it on there. And that's kind of like how it looks on your leg. And you're just going to massage it. Yeah, it's going to roll off like that. That's what we want, okay? You can massage it as far up to up through your leg as you want to. It kind of just depends on how much of your leg you want to be super silky. If you got a photo shoot going on, you definitely want to take it up to your whole leg, especially if you're doing swimsuit. And you want to massage your leg as if it was somebody else that was massaging your leg and not just you. And kind of do that as a gauge to how you want it to feel and how smooth you want your legs to be. Your, the key to this is trying to get the dead skin off of your legs so you'll have a closer shave the next time and your legs will be so silky smooth, guys. So super silky smooth. And if you have a problem with rough knees, you can pay special attention to your knees when you do this and get some of that dead skin off of it, which will help with maybe brightening your knees up if you have a problem with dark knees, like I kind of do, yeah. So you're just going to continue this for a little bit until your hands get really tired. 
and until your leg feels sufficiently tingly. And you can rinse off this leg and then do the next one. Or you can just do both legs at the same time and then rinse them off at the same time at the end of this video. So I'm going to go ahead just and do rinse the, the mixture next leg. off of my legs. And now I'm going to shave again. So with the previous step, you should have noticed when you were doing your shaving that there was a lot of dead skin coming off. And that's because of the scrub that we created. Now, if you nicked yourself like I did, because I'm kind of silly, I guess, um, <laughs> you will notice that the lemon juice actually uh, causes it to burn a little bit. So please don't nick yourself while you're doing this. If you can avoid it, please do. So now we're going to add the mixture to your legs, the same process as earlier. We're going to do that again to These both legs. These are the finished stems. Ooh la la, my legs are so nice. Ladies, feel your legs. Feel how soft your legs feel. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So now, <laughs> now that they're all nice and supple and incredibly smooth, Remind yourself to put some lotion on after this because moisture is key. So put some and lotion on right now. Your gorgeous stems are now complete. They're so smooth. I love this recipe so much, you guys. It's just perfect. Also, a little tip for those of you who model. Um, the oil, like the olive oil or whatever, is a really great way to get the wet look like to get the glistening water look on your body if you're doing that kind of modeling, swimsuit modeling, that's the trick to get the water to glisten is to use oil. So that's a little trick for all you models out there. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. Check the, check the description box for more information and stay tuned for more videos. I love you. Bye lovelies. Mwah! Stay beautiful.